in the studios, Claire uh, Pearsall. Um, uh, I mean, just in terms of you know the Trump impact, um, it, you know, it's fascinating how many of our callers have brought that up actually about you know international affairs. I mean, I, I do think that Obama, who I you know I'm really very excited about his election was an abject failure in terms of the world stage as a president, in terms of basically, oh, here's my red line in Syria. Oh, I'm just going to ignore it. I mean, he withdrew. When America withdraws from the world, that's very rarely good for the world. Do you think Donald Trump would be, if he becomes president again, would be a cause for peace? And how would he go about that? I'm really surprised that people think that Donald Trump will bring peace. I just, I can't square that away with, with the man that, that is in front of us on the cameras. But having said that, there weren't any conflicts during his time. Now, whether is that, that a matter is of luck, luck? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I think that is. Do I trust him to handle those kind of foreign affairs? I'm not convinced. Yeah. He doesn't have a great standing on the world stage for diplomacy. Now, the diplomacy isn't always what it's cracked up to be, but I think you need a level of it before you can go in there, before you can calm something down. Yeah, although I, get, I quite like the banging heads. My thing <laughs> worry is he just, I just think he just give, he seems to admire strong men, and I think he'd give yeah. in to Vladimir Putin and things. And he, I, think, I think Ukraine would just lose all of their funding, and I, I, I care very strongly about Ukraine being able to defeat uh, and oust Russia from their borders, yeah. but there we are. Right, well, look, an awful lot more to talk about. Now, I've been asking you the question today, after that landslide victory for Donald Trump in the Iowa race to become the Republican candidate for US president, would you welcome a second Trump presidency and why? Our numbers to call are 03444991000. You can text on 8722 or get in touch on X at Talk TV. And you've been doing just that in your droves. Rob says, just imagine the moment when Starmer meets Trump. I'd pay to view that cringe event. Oh, do you know what? <laughs> That is, that would be worth that it. Would that would be, be worth it. And Sadiq Khan having to face him again as well. Oh. There'd be another blimp. I wish that was just human. Oh, yes, I wish that was yeah. awful. It's like, it doesn't matter whether you like someone or not. And that's, he's the elected president, a democratically elected president. Um, Albie says, we need a Trump here to cut through the nonsense politicians we have. Trump gets things done and does what he says he will do. Again, another big theme. And Yasmin says, how do the absolute worst candidates get offered for election? There's lots of intelligent people in America, yet we get these frauds. I'm wondering if he's meaning Biden as well as Trump. You've also been getting in touch on the phones, of course, 0344 uh, Richard has uh, get, called that number. He's in London. Hello to you, Richard. Hi there, Julia. How are things? They're very well indeed. All the better for speaking to you. Do, would you welcome a second Trump presidency? Absolutely not. I really, really wouldn't. And one of the things that you brought up this morning is, is, is like stuck on me that we just don't have... I mean, a backup option for the Democrats. You'd mentioned that Biden still isn't fully confirmed if he's going to run or not. And we're just, it's quite a major concern that we need someone who's got their finger on the button and who's got a finger, finger yeah. on things at the moment because the world has changed dramatically over the last four or five years since Trump was in power. Yeah. Um, well, that's, and you look at the Democrats, I mean, Kamala Harris is, is just beyond useless and awful. I mean, Absolutely. Gavin Newsom, they've looked at. There's, another, there's a couple of other names, but again, I don't know who... I mean, Gavin Newsom, again, massive lockdown hypocrite, the usual. Yeah. Stay in your homes, kids can't go to school, three-year-olds in masks, but, oh, by the way, I'm off at a restaurant secretly and hoping no-one notices me and my other rich friends doing it. I mean, literally, these people should be hounded from polite society, let alone be re-elected. But, I mean, yeah. who, there's no-one. There's just absolutely no-one, and they're not putting anyone forward, and that's a major concern. As someone who... Who is a, a, a centre um, leftist and would be a, a Labour voter in the next election? I just feel that we need someone who's can be comparative to um, Keir Starmer, and I just don't think we've got that. With, you want with someone him. like Keir Starmer? Well, I, not fully like Keir, but along those lines. Some, back, Starmer, but back in I, I'm always fascinated. Like someone like Keir Starmer. I don't even know what Keir Starmer is. I've, you know, I've met the guy. I don't. I don't know what he stands for. I don't know what he believes in, other than I know he hates Brexit, which is like the biggest democratic vote in his nation's history. I mean, yeah. he's literally the anti-Trump in that respect. I mean, I, I would probably say that he, he is probably more along the lines of anti-Trump, and I don't think that's a, a, a great thing, a great stance to have. As you mentioned, with world leaders, you have to have a, have a certain attitude towards yeah. him. I don't think that maybe Trump has got, Sam has got that correct attitude. Exactly. If you're, I, mean, if you're, I think if, you, if you're willing to welcome Xi Jinping or the Saudi king to, to this country, you know, lay out the red carpet... Maybe be polite to the uh, to the American oh, president who's absolutely. actually an ally, whoever it is. Um, David, so Richard, apologies, Richard. Thank you very much indeed for calling. Appreciate that. Lots of different views. Keep your views coming in. Uh, do give us a call, particularly 0344 499 1000.